Hey everyone, this is Danish from jobskillshare.org vlog. Guys, I got a new topic today and the topic is I'm trying to get into IT job. I'm thinking to start an IT job, meaning like the entry level IT support job, help desk, desktop support, user support, IT support, whatever you want to call it. It's an entry level IT job where you help users. And you're thinking, is it okay for me to spend thirty to sixty thousand dollars and go to the community college? Like that's your that's your uh, confusion right there. Is it okay? Now, if you are that person right now, if you are in this category, and you don't know anything about the free resources online right now, that like Professor Messers have A plus courses, we have a full courses. There, most of them are free uh, and all these resources then if you're listening to this video your confusion is gone it's not okay for you to go to community college and spend sixty thousand dollars to get into IT entry-level IT position anyone can come to me and say you know what no it's they put they show you a lot of hands-on stuff this and that and this and that you know you learn the only goal for you to be is more, you have to think it in a very, um, you know, it's a business. You have to get in. You have to get yourself in somehow. Once you get in, it's really up to the company what type of technology they use and what type of setup they have. Okay? They will teach you. If you have a desire to learn, they will teach you. You will learn yourself. Because the day you get hired, the next day you will be thinking that the the whole night you will be thinking you know what I need to learn this because I use this product I use this software in this company and they're gonna have issues it's in nature it's in a human nature that you will start you will get up and start looking for information and trying to get yourself um, you know you'll learn about it and then the next day you'll start working so a lot of people are stuck in this in this little uh, circle okay what they do is they 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 start something they'll go and then they'll start like a college courses and stuff like that and then they'll start taking these courses and by the time they're they finish with the courses there are already new courses now and then you're confused again okay man i just finished 2008 server god damn there's like 2012 server this 2016 server right now where do you start like where do you, where do you stop the learning part my idea to you guys is this I don't care if you guys are going to community college go go anywhere you want to if you have money and everything but if you're in this position where you're you're trying to get into IT you need to apply let me tell you yes I tell you right now a lot of people will disagree with me but I do things a little different and I the whole course that I did and this whole course platform that I have is a different and that's why it's so effective that it's it's all in your head you know, you basically start these two courses like help this ticketing system, Active Directory, Microsoft Office 365. You can finish these courses in three days or even two days. They're so small, but they're so effective that this is all they do. Like, you know, some company, for example, will hire you just for doing ticketing. Ticketing, meaning like you get a call, you know who to assign it to. That's your job right there. And then you start learning more like troubleshooting skills like browser troubleshooting, a uh, little basic computer troubleshooting, backup stuff, working with the user, Microsoft Office. This stuff, you know, you will learn it on the job, but there's some basic stuff like Active Directory, adding a user, deleting a user, this is a, this is a process. You, you keep doing that again and again, again and again. So this is why I tell people, the ticketing system course, Active Directory and Office 365, you take these courses and start applying. Now why I say apply it, and some people say, oh, I don't have experience, hands-on experience. No, the hands-on experience, you will learn it. It's really up to the company and the hiring people because there could be 10 companies, okay? Out of 10 companies, five will be looking for exactly what they want. They might need a person who has a lot of hands-on experience so then the other IT person is not showing or not teaching. Now. There could be other five companies 
they are just they have already people and they say you know what bring people who wants to learn we want to teach them because some IT people love to teach and they would love to get new people so then they can teach them it's, it's just a personal satisfaction okay so and or some companies might have a time limit kind of thing you know they their IT person might leave one guy and then now they really really want someone who can just quickly learn and bam start working on these applications like I said when you go to the company they have their own setup guys so all you need to learn is some basic stuff and start applying and, I, and my focus is to to the people who are saying that look I am going to college I've been spent three months for studying I did this this that that I still not getting a job first you're not applying you're not applying like you should be you first go to these these pages when you wake up in the morning you start shooting your resume I don't care what uh, experience level they ask just shoot your resume because if you have these basic courses done at least you know some basic you know ticketing system you know office 365 you know active directory stuff and some basic troubleshooting and everything is in our courses right now so you you must be lucky right now if you look into listen to this video you don't even have to go out if you go to jobskillshare.org everything is in the same track right now help desk ticketing system actual directory office 365 these are all terms that people will ask you in your interview and trust me you don't need to spend sixty thousand dollars just to get an entry-level IT job no sixty sixty thousand dollars spending guys don't do that if you are doing that donate some to me so that I can make my system even better <laughs> you'll have more success with that so yeah it's just my personal opinion a lot of people ask these questions I go to forums and it's all over again and again and again and again uh, think a little different way and you will have success because a lot of people are thinking the same way and they're using the same circle that people get in you go to the community college you start taking courses and at the end you you give up because you think that by the end of these courses technology is already changed so think and act in a smart way and you'll have success thank you